Watching. We are at the Lake George YMCA. You know what this reminds me of, you guys? This reminds me of Dirty Dancing. It's like a camp with the old buildings and a little church and tennis courts. And oh my gosh, this is so much like Dirty Dancing. I love that movie. Look at this place. Oh, this is so cool. Oh, this is so neat. I am nervous about driving home super late at night, but we'll figure it out. Hi. I'm about to get a haircut. My hair looks terrible. Terrible. And I've been amusing myself doing that voice that I've been hearing a lot lately. And I told Country Girl a funny story that happened a couple days ago. I was at the gym in a class. I heard this voice in the class saying, oh my gosh, where did you get those pants? They're really cute. Were they expensive? And I thought, where is that voice coming from? What is that? It turned out to be the teacher. And she began to tell this story as class started. She was teaching another class and a woman began going like this. And understandably, she's the teacher and she's instructing the class. So she was thinking, like, why is she shushing me? And she kept teaching the class and this woman keeps shh. And she finally said, why are you shushing me? And the woman said, I don't like your voice. Now, that's not really, that's not okay. But it is interesting that other people have noticed and I wonder if it's made her more aware of her squeaky toy voice I don't know has anyone seen the movie in a world I love this movie and Lake Bell who wrote it directed it stars in it discusses this epidemic as she really calls it and I think it is one too I'm just suddenly noticing this everywhere it's crazy so let's be on the lookout and just be listening. Hmm, it's very interesting. What does this say? What is this saying? What is this vein saying? I'm alive. I'm definitely alive. So pretty. I haven't shown my face uh, since earlier. But anyway, I don't know. They always make the musicians park really far away. And so I just talked to some guys down the hill and they said I could park down there. So I'm now walking back up the hill to go grab my car. And I didn't film it, but there was a chipmunk that came running across my feet earlier. So hopefully he's not rabid. Anyway, so beautiful here. So pretty. I had been telling Country Girl that I'd been at the musical Waitress, which I've visited a couple of times a few days before. There was someone in our row who was probably in her early 20s, late teens. She said, Oh, I'm so, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Excuse me. I'm over there. Excuse me. I'm sorry. And it was just so jarring because she sounded like a, a, a toy. Remember the dolls with the pulley? <laughs> Those are kind of old. She must have said, I'm sorry, 10 million times in two hours. And I said, you have nothing to be sorry about because she didn't. I'm so sorry, I'm sorry, excuse me, excuse me, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. And I just started thinking about it a lot and thinking, you know what? I used to speak in a much higher voice. I don't think I ever had the nasally voice, but, um, I think uh, it's just something to think about because I don't think that that is our real voice and I say our because I did it too so I want to hear real voices I want to hear real voices <laughs>
Lake George, everybody. Lake George. What's going on, Sue Girl? Oh, hey! We were just talking about voices. Yeah, and like, please just like try to find your voice. It's not in here. It's not in here. It's in here. And right? Is it in here? But it's in here. It's, it's not in here. It's not in here. <laughs> Thank you so much. This has been your public service <laughs> announcement. I didn't give you guys any clue, or you friends, any clue that <laughs> I was meeting up with City Girl. Hi! <laughs> look at these sun rays, everyone. Yeah, look. They're amazing. Wow. Going to go play wedding. Let's get a picture in front. Oh, yeah. Look at this, it's like we're in the forest. It is like <gasps> Let's see this. And framed perfectly wow. is the Statue sure. of Liberty. similar to what she wanted to base the original uh, Dirty Dancing on. It's a YMCA. You can come here, there's families. You can play tennis or wiffle ball or whatever that is. And go swimming at the lake, go dancing. There's, we're playing the concert up here. Look at the buildings. I am in a freaking Dirty Dancing campus. And you know that scene that we're maybe goes to tell her dad? That she's with what's his name? Is that not the scene? This is the scene, you guys. Yeah. Yeah, no, I don't know the words. Oh, 
Okay. What American song do you like to listen to? Yes. Oh. Oh, see the dawn's early light. Well, so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleam. Whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight Your neighbors are loving us. Yeah.